everyone. Welcome to Yayi's Corner. I hope you guys are having a great time. I apologize for my voice. I'm getting over COVID, so, but I've got to get these videos out. Today's the second day I feel okay. So I said, okay, let me put on some makeup, do my hair, and let's just get on with life. All right, guys. If you're new to my channel, my channel's called Yayi's Corner. You can also follow me on Instagram at Yayi's Corner as well. All right, so today I have some exciting um, things to show you. I am going to show you what I purchased during the Charlotte Tilbury. I think it was 40% off. So I got some pretty good things, I have to say. And I wish I had known about this when I purchased the Pillow Talk face palette. Um, but anyways, I'm glad I got that. And then some Gucci Cosmetics um, products that I picked up. All right, guys, so let's get started. So I went ahead and I repurchased. This has to be one of the first palettes, uh, bronzer highlighter palettes I had ever purchased in my life. And mine is old. It's old and I've used that thing to death. So I went ahead and I repurchased, but this time it came with a little brush. So you see, so this is the limited edition Filmstar Bronze and Glow. And this is in the color, uh, let's see. I know I picked the lighter color. This is in the light medium, okay. This packaging is so pretty. Okay. So this is the bronzer and this is the highlight. I used this thing. Okay, and then look at the adorable brush it comes with. This is the mini powder, mini powder and sculpt. Okay. Super nice dense but fluffy at the same time just beautiful so <clears throat> i remember when i first um got my hands on this years ago oh my goodness i use this for bronzing highlighting i use it for my eyes because these are my favorite eye colors i mean like this is all over right inner corner uh brow bone and then this is the crease and then just as an all over just mix them both beautiful Loved it, loved it, loved it. Okay, so I'm glad I got this. <clears throat> so then I was also, I've been eyeing this for a long time. It's the Super Nudes Easy Eye Palette. And I should have bought it when it was, I think it was free with a purchase in Nordstrom or one of those. Um, one of those Super Nudes. Okay, again, beautiful packaging. Oh, I like it that she has, that's what I love about her, that she does help you. <laughs> wow. Very nice. Very, very nice. Simple. Everyone needs, and it looks like these are nudes or satin, but they almost look nude. I mean, everyone needs a palette like this. Nice and easy. Nothing too complicated. I can't wait to start using this. And finally... I got my hands on. A lot of you asked if I was going to um, get my hands on this. So this is the, well, there's something I have to say, and I don't know if many of you are going to agree, but the packaging, I mean, look at the difference. Okay. Look at the difference in this packaging, you know, nice, simple. And this, it's full of letters. It's full of, I don't like that. I, it, it just, ugh, it irritates me. It irritates me on so so many levels. And, you know, her packaging, well, let me just read what it is. It says, science and color, beautiful skin, sunkissed glow bronzer. Just call it sunkissed glow bronzer. That's it. There's no need to tell me what it does. All this you can tell me here in the back. Soothing, healthy, looking glow cream bronzer for face and body infused with hyaluronic acid, vitamin D. 
And then she's ha she has science and color again. Why? Okay, it's in French. But it boosts hydration by 136% in one hour. Okay. And skin appears smoother by 42%. Lightly buff onto skin and blend with the beautiful skin bronzer brush for an all-over sun-kissed glow. All right, so I've got it in the color fair because the medium looked a little too orangey for me, okay? Now, <clears throat> so I've heard great things about this product. All right, so I just wish she was consistent in her packaging. Um, look, okay, so we've got three, three Charlotte Tilbury um, Okay, I don't want to drop any of these. I get it, this is limited edition, but I mean, guys, I just, this is gorgeous. I wish all her packaging was either like, like this, in this type of packaging. Oh, wow, that would have been gorgeous. So, <clears throat> so you look at it in the front, I think it is, maybe it's plastic. Okay, that looks fine, but look at the back. Really, I don't need all that wording again. I don't. Anyways, I think I'm just being picky, but okay. So now it looks quite dark. So let's swatch this. Now I'm hoping that this is not. Okay, no, it's not. It's not balmy or greasy. Oh, it's nice. Wow. That really feels really nice. I really can't smell. I don't think there's any smell. Wow. This is gorgeous, guys. You were all right about this. Okay, I can't wait to use this. I can't wait to do a look for you using all this. And my goddess. Um, oh, no, because that's the goddess eye palette. And I'll use the super notes and that's it. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I'm very happy with these purchases. All right, so I picked up the new, this has been a little bit controversial, okay? Um, the price is ridiculous on these palettes. Uh, when, I saw, when I saw the first one that came out, I was like, oh my God, that's beautiful. But then I was like, how am I gonna use these eyeshadows? but the packaging reminded me of my grandmother. And I have to say I was, and then when I saw the second one come out, I was like, oh my God, it's, the packaging is just gorgeous. It's something my grandmother would have kept on her side um, table. Absolutely, she would have kept it. Um, so yes, I think this was more of an emotional buy more than anything else. So I purchased the Gucci Gorgeous Flora number no. two palette, okay? <clears throat> now I contemplated am I gonna keep these I mean I haven't even swatched them am I gonna keep these what am I gonna do with these I mean they come in this nice velvety pouch okay it says Gucci right there I'm sure you've seen a million of these videos guys this is heavy look at this how beautiful Okay, press it and okay so it's so funny because when I saw these and I saw the pan size I was like what you're kidding me they had so much more room here to do bigger pants and um, Abby Bliss White she said she was hilarious because she said when I saw this it reminded me of um, play makeup you know the type of makeup you get for little girls and it's mostly like these colors <laughs> I was like I was like oh my god she's absolutely right anyways um look I can I I can I kind of see I think how they want us to use it or how it was meant to be used like this is a quad this is a quad and this is a quad okay um yeah and then this comes out. It's supposed to be refillable, but I mean, 
the packaging is i mean they didn't skip on packaging but look how thin this is look at this i mean my my gum is thicker than this so yeah guys i don't know i mean the packaging is gorgeous it's something that you can put on your vanity and your vanity your vanity that's all it needs <laughs> So with this purchase, um, they gave me a gift with purchase and it was, I'll show you now, it was the Gucci Flora Gorgeous Jasmine Perfume. This perfume, or what is this? Yeah, it's Eau de, Perf Eau de Perfume. Okay. And it's a pretty, I mean, it's, it's pretty big. It's one ounce. Now, the thing is, when I first smelled it, when I first tried, when I first sprayed it on, I could not, I didn't smell anything. This says, um, Grande Florum Jasmine. Magnolia Accord and Mandarin Essence. I'm gonna attempt to smell it again. I don't know if it's my COVID that doesn't let me smell it. Okay, I smell it now. <laughs> it was COVID. Hmm. It's very, it's very floral. This is paper. I don't know if it's me. It's not. It's not um, knocking my socks off. Nope. It's beautiful packaging, but I don't know. It's not. Maybe I have to let it sit for a while and see how. Mm. Okay, we'll see. So then I said, all right, so since I'm purchasing the second palette, I might as well go ahead and buy the first one. So, because I personally liked this palette, the look of it, much better than this second one. Okay. For whatever reason, I like the black one better. And I also thought that it has more nudes so if you like this makes sense to me this makes sense and this makes sense okay i don't think i'll ever use this blue i don't know i say never but um yeah so that's how i see it they intended us to use these four here the four in the middle now this is a beautiful these are gorgeous colors so is this one. Yeah, so again, my gosh, this thing is heavy. So very beautiful packaging. Is it worth $152? Is the yeah, I don't know about that. So we'll see. I haven't swatched it. To be honest, my mind's not 100 percent made up whether or not I'm gonna keep them. Um you know, after looking at it in person, because there's nowhere I can see these um, in a department store where I live. Um, after seeing them in person, it's a little bit underwhelming, um, especially the size and not the packaging, but just the size. Then I also purchased, oh my gosh, I love their lipsticks. The, um, the lipstick that came out with the second palette, it was like a light corally peachy color, and I don't think that was going to you know, I didn't want to spend that kind of money on a lipstick. I don't really like the colors. So I just said, you know, I'm just going to go with another color that I know I'm into. Okay, I have this already. <clears throat> so I picked up the Gucci Glow and Care Lip Color 
in Lynette Stone 113. This color is, I've already used it. Guys, this color is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, look at that. These lipsticks are so moisturizing. Mm. And I love that brown color. Love it, love it, love it. I love these lipsticks. All right, guys, so that's it for my luxury makeup haul. Um, stay tuned for some uh, other videos. I have another haul I want to do. It's not new makeup, but it's new to me, and it's brands I've never tried out before. But, oh my gosh, when I look at the colors, when I look at the quality of the, you know, videos describing the quality of the, of the products, it's like uh okay <laughs> so stay tuned that will be coming soon and i thank you for watching bye